It's Jack here. I'm at the Pasadena Western today for uh, th exactly 300 guests, uh, 300 guests wedding. It's our first time back in almost about a year and a half. Um, yeah, we did lighting and uh, Shivara chairs and we also did a well, big backdrop right there. We do a big backdrop because there's no many door there, so it looks like you know, it conceals the doors. Uh, yeah, these are silver Shivaris with mint green lighting. We actually did rigging up there. We brought 24 pin lights that we rigged off the ceiling to, uh, I believe the bride told us she wants all the high center pieces to be highlighted. So this is what it looks like. Um, there's a fee associated with hanging up the ceiling. You generally have to get the approval from the from the hotel and to get, I believe there's like a, a fee involved. But like I said, uh, you've seen all my work with uh, with highlighted uh, center pieces. So literally, you can change the color of the, this is where my controller is here. You can change the color of just a different color whole room you want a pink you want a blush you want a uh, blue and then this is all off so this one looks like all off but it's early it's about 12 o'clock in the afternoon we're already setting up getting ready for we'll probably yeah for the side of the wedding I've done 330 here before that was a that was actually a company party but 300 as you can tell it's pretty pretty compact um, but waiting on this side, so I generally, if I, would, if I was to DJ, I'm actually DJing the LA River Center. If I was to DJ here, I would brought one sub and probably three speakers. Because if you put two speakers on the side here, people over there can't hear. So you literally have to put like probably one speaker on the dance floor and two, two peripheral speakers. That's the thing about DJing in a room this type, but unfortunately, it is what it is. I'm out.